today we're learning all about chickens. This is a book about a chicken's life cycle from egg to chicken. Let's look inside. Okay, so it's written by Dr. Gerald Legg and illustrated, so the pictures are dark, by Carolyn Scarce. Let's have a read. So, tell your adult what kind of book this is, okay? It's got a contents page, so that's a clue. Did you get it right? It's a non-fiction book, so it's not a story. It's a book that gives us facts. So this is helping us learn how an egg changes into a chicken. So on the contents page, we can find out about egg laying, brooding, enemies, the new chick, and the page numbers help us find the pages that we need. Okay, so a chicken is a bird. All birds have feathers and two wings. Chickens start life inside an egg. A chick hatches from the egg and grows into a chicken. In this book, you can see this amazing life cycle unfold. The hen collects straw to make a nest. Then she will line the nest with feathers to make a soft bed. There she is. And it says a hen is a female, so a girl or a lady, chicken. She's the mummy. The hen lays her eggs in the nest. She lays several eggs at a time. Each egg holds and protects a baby bird. The egg also contains yolk, which provides food for the young chick. There she is, and out pops the egg. Bop, 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 bop. At first, the young chick is just a tiny dot called an embryo. You used to be an embryo. As the embryo grows, it begins to look like a bird. The embryo lies in albumen, a jelly-like substance which is soft and warm. There it is. So there you can see it says yolk, embryo, albumen, and air space at one end of the egg allows the chick to breathe. The hen is a good mother. She keeps her eggs safe and warm. By sitting on them, she surrounds them with her soft feathers. This is called brooding. We're gonna think about what brooding means in a minute. Here she is, sitting on her eggs. Every now and then she, or the mother hen, turns the eggs to keep them warm all over. So a bit like when you're um, toasting bread and you have to turn it over so it's toasty on both sides. Hens need to protect their eggs. Birds, foxes, lizards, snakes and humans all like to eat eggs. Oh yes we do. To get at the food inside, some animals bite and peck at the eggshell. Others smash it with stones. There it is, sneaky fox in the background. After 12 days, the baby chick inside the egg starts to make a cheeping noise. Cheep, cheep, cheep. This lets the mother hen know that her chick will hatch soon. Then the eggshell begins to crack. Crack! Hello. Hello, Eliza. The chick uses a special tooth called an egg tooth to break out of the eggshell. When it first hatches, the chick is wet all over, but soon it dries out and looks like a fluffy yellow ball. The hen scratches around for food. The chicks follow her. Older chicks are more brave, but they still stay near their mother. 
Chicks make a cheeping noise so that their mother always knows where they are. That is certainly true. As the chicks get older, new feathers grow. In a few months, the chick will look like its mother or father. A female chicken is ready to lay her first eggs when she is about 25 weeks old. So that's the life cycle. It starts with an egg, they grow into a chick, then a chicken. The chicken lays eggs and it starts all over again. It goes round and round and round. This type of chicken is called a bantam. It has a bright red comb on its head like this. Just there. Chicken facts. We've got some chicken facts now. Okay. Did you know that ostriches from Africa lay the largest eggs? They weigh 3.9 kilograms and take 40 minutes to cook. That's a long time to wait for breakfast. Eggs are strong. They will support four kilograms before breaking. That's chicken eggs. That's an experiment that you could try. The largest ever chicken egg was 31 centimetres long and had five yolks. That would feed a lot of people breakfast. The smallest eggs are laid by hummingbirds. They weigh around 0 0.35 grams, so not very much at all. The most eggs ever laid by a chicken in a year was 371. That is a busy, busy mother hen. Most eggs are oval shaped like this. But owls' eggs are round. Did you know that? I did not. A good laying hen will produce 250 to 300 eggs a year. It's a lot of laying. So that's some facts about chicken. Now you could learn some more about chicken. So you could make some eggs. Could you fry an egg with your Advil? Scramble an egg? Make some pancakes? Make a cake even. They're essential for cakes. Could you watch a video about uh, an egg being incubated and hatching out into a chick? That would be really interesting to see. Could you print off the pictures of the life cycle of a chicken, cut them out and put them in order? And, really important, write some sentences to go with them. Could you research Picasso? He's one of my favourite artists and he painted funky chickens. So check out Picasso's funky chickens and try painting a funky chicken too. Now, we've been learning a lot about new words using our beanstalks, and we learnt some new words then in that book. So, we've got some no words. We know that a chicken is a bird that lays eggs that we can eat or grows into another chicken. A chicken. We know that word. And egg. The hard oval shaped shell that surrounds a bird or reptile embryo. Here we go. So we know these words, chicken and egg. Now we've got some grow words, some new words that we didn't know before and we want to use a little bit more. So surround, my turn, surround, your turn, surround. And that means all the way around. The embryo was surrounded by albumen and that is surrounded by the eggshell. All the way around. Grow. Brooding, when the mother hen sits on her eggs to keep them warm. Your turn, when the mother hen sits on her eggs to keep them warm. Brooding. Now there's other meanings of the word brooding. See if you can find out what brooding means. Protect, this is a really important word, okay? My turn, protect, your turn, protect. Take care of or keep away from harm. Your turn, protect. Take care of and keep away from harm. Protect. So the mother hen protects her eggs. That's another grow word for us. Brooding, surround and protect. Those words are grow words because they help us uh, use them in lots of different ways. So we don't have to just use those words when we're learning about chickens. Now, words we use when we're learning about eggs or chickens, some show words are words like albumen. So albumen, the white jelly-like part of the egg that surrounds the growing chick. Your turn. The white jelly-like part of the egg that surrounds the growing chick. And that's a show word. So that goes all the way up here. Go, go, gadget arm. And one more. Embryo. The beginning of a young, young animal before it can move or looks like anything. When it's a tiny little dot. Your turn, embryo, the beginning of a young animal. 
just like you.